Hey everyone, it's Brent with Limelight Results and in this video I'm going to show you how to create a landing page for your business page on Facebook. So what is a landing page? Well a landing page is, is a place where people land on before they go to your wall. So it gives you an opportunity to kind of tell what you're about. I mean because if you go to somebody's wall initially the very first time and it's a business that doesn't always really give you a good idea what the business is about or what the page is about. So a landing page gives you an opportunity to kind of introduce, you know, what you're what you're about, what your business does, and you, it also gives you the ability to um, you can send them to your website from your landing page, or you can have an opt-in to your newsletter or email, and you can also you know have a call to action there to you know either call you or uh, click to become a fan or actually it's called like now not a fan um, right up here you wanted to click this like button previously was uh, become a fan so there's a couple things you can do now what I'm going to do is show you how to do that how to set that up you click edit page and what we're going to do is add an application right here it's static FBML if this doesn't show up for some reason you would click here under browse more and you could search for it here by entering you know um, there it is so I'll just select it from here now what this is, the static FBML, the FBML stands for Facebook Markup Language. Now it's Facebook's own language to create, um, that you can use on your Facebook account. It's kind of similar to something you may have heard of called HTML. And HTML is code to, that you can use to build websites with. So don't worry though, you're not going to have to know um, you know, learn any new language. All right, now what we're going to do is we want to add this to our page. So click Add to My Page, select the page you want to add it to, click Close. Okay, now it's on that page. Now we want to go back to the page. And now you'll see it's created a tab, FBML1 right here. Now you can move these around as well. You can drag them over. Now what we want to do is set up our landing page. Now I've already created an image that I want to be as my landing page. So when somebody searches for Limelight results, I want them to go to the landing page and see this image. So I'm going to click, oh, actually I'm going to click edit page we're going to go back to that application right here, FBML, click Edit. Now we want to give it a title. We're going to select Welcome, and that's going to replace what was there, FBML1, on the tabs. Now here's where you enter code. You can put in HTML code if you uh, know HTML code or have it, or you can use the Facebook markup language, but you know I prefer just to use HTML. So if you don't know HTML, then you'll have to have somebody, you know, do this part for you. But I've already created an image. Let me show the image to you. This is the image. I already created this. This is going to be the landing page. This is what people are going to land on when they search. So this gives them a, you know, a little better idea of what the business is all about. Okay, so to get that to display, I've already loaded that image on my web server. So I'm just going to enter in a little HTML code here. And all this code does is points to where I've loaded that image on my, on my hosting account for my website.
Again, don't worry about the code if you don't understand the code. All this is doing is pointing to that image I just showed you, the landing page image. And I'm changing the tab name to Welcome. So I'm going to save this. And there, see it's FBML1 is not there anymore. It's replaced with Welcome. So if we click on it, it'll show that image. Okay, now it's showing the image. It's kind of cut off but because of uh, the left and the right here. But when somebody searches, it'll show the full image. And then, like I said, there's a, you know, there's a call to action you can put. I put here, you know, click the like button. You want, you want to have people click the like button. Okay, so that's pretty much it. That's how you create a landing page. Um, and again, you really do want to create one of these. Uh, you want to create it because, again, it gives people a better idea of what you're all about, what your business does, than them just going straight to your wall. And you also can put different tabs up here. Uh, you can, you know, you can put YouTube or Twitter, or, uh, you know, different things. And in other later videos, I'll go into that as well. So, if you had any questions about this or liked it, um, feel free to contact me and let me know. I'll see you on the next video.